in the kitchen, he's got no shoes on his feet. He's cleaning up what he grabbed his meat with his right hand. And I'm not talking about his provolone. I'm talking. <laughs> Wait, baloney. Hello, ladles, jelly spoons, and other non binary kitchen utensils. This is another episode of Cooking with Uncle Frank. And on this episode, we're going to be making chicken pot pie casserole. Don't really have a recipe following. We're just going to be putting stuff together, making a casserole. How do you mess up a chicken pot pie? How do you mess up a casserole? You can't. You probably have to work to mess up a casserole. But in this, we're of course going to have chicken. Potatoes, onions, carrots, celery, got some peas too. Maybe we'll put corn in there. I don't think we're going to put corn in there. I don't know. We're just going to get wild with it. And I've got one wild card recipe that we're going to be dumping in this bad boy. And uh, it's probably going to make, I don't know how many portions, but I'm probably going to eat it in like three days. Probably give some people some too. It's going to be tasty. Well, let's get cooking. Yee yee! Alright, so we're gonna start cooking up our chicken here. Yeah. Got our chick 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 chicken going. And then I'm over here dicing up some veggies. I'm doing my potatoes. What I do? Is I looked at some recipe and they said to use like frozen potatoes on brine or some some nonsense like that. I'm not doing that. I need regular old potatoes, fresh potatoes. I'm cutting them up right now, and uh, I'm gonna toss them in the old panaroo and fry them too before we put them in the old mixture. I'm not going to make you guys watch all of this, but I think it's uh, pretty important. We need to put the uh, correct emphasis on the correct syllable. That you probably need to uh, cook your chicken before you continue with the uh, rest of the recipe. Huh? Right? Okay. I figured, I mean, I don't know if y'all want to catch that, that, that Pokemon, you know, that Salmonella Mon, you know what I'm saying? No, you don't want that. Put your chicken. Make it flavorful. Put some of uh, Uncle Chris's gourmet fucking steak seasoning on there. Yeah, why not? Thanks, Uncle Chris. Oh yeah, look at that. Ah. Oh. Bill Gates, when are we going to get smell of you jerk? You faggin' jerk off? I mean, come on, this smells amazing. But who owns YouTube? Is there one evil person that owns YouTube? Or is it just like one evil person that uh, owns like Facebook? Wait. Yeah, is there any one evil person? Like one single, singular evil entity that like... Owns, uh, that owns YouTube besides Google? I mean, I mean, like, Google, we know Google, Alphabet, blah, blah, blah. Is there one evil person to blame, or did they figure out some way to where, like, there's just, like, a board of, like, 12 people that you don't know about who are, like, evil? Because, you know, you'd always, like, pick out, like, Elon Musk, or, like, Steve Jobs, or, like, Bill Gates. Who's that evil person? Hey Google, it's a goose. Cobra Commander? It's probably Cobra Commander. I bet you it's Cobra Commander. That's a whiz bang we didn't fucking think about, did we? Guy Joe trying to warn us about the evil of Cobra Commander and shit. We won't pay no damn attention. Huh. We don't goof. We don't goof. So when the chicken's done, I'm gonna cook all the old potatoes. All right. All right. We got our chicken cooked. 
we got our veggies chopped so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna cube up that there chicken and then I'm gonna cook the potatoes and onions together in all that nasty gross chicken fat and grease which is barely any in there <clears throat> and then uh, after that I'm going to cook the uh, celery and carrots together yeah yeah and then we're gonna mix all this up with some other stuff and then we're gonna play with some uh, pie dough and I'm lazy I bought pie stuff I didn't make it from the ground up cuz I'm lazy ain't that right master chef I'm lazy all right all right all right all right let's get a chopping and a cooking Oh yeah, look at our potato and onion mixture going, look at that. And after this, after these get softened up and caramelized a little bit, we're going to work on our carrots and celery mixture. And then we're going to put all this into one big pot with the uh, chicken chunks. Once those are cooked up, we're going to put this in a big old thing, and then we're going to start mixing it up, and we're going to make our filling, our filling, our filling for our chicken pot pie. Casserole. All right. Keep on rolling, baby. So we have our carrots and celery cooked. Damn near cooked. Look at that. That looks amazing. I just want to eat that right now. We got our potatoes and onions mixed up, all cooked up, all good. Nom 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 nom. Then we get our chicken breasts all cooked up and cubed. And getting here pretty soon. We're gonna have to whip out the old uh the old sauce. A little sauce for the uh, chicken pot pie casserole. Yeah. So we're going to mix all this up. Carrots and celery. Potatoes and onions. And that there chicken. And uh, we're going to make our filling. And then we are going to spread out our dough in a big old pan might be <laughs> we may have made too much we probably made too much just like the chili and then uh, we'll have to put it in like a couple different pans and then uh, well we're gonna put the dough on top and then I guess we're gonna have to bake it bake it bake it bake it bake it so we forgot something you gotta unroll your pre-packaged garbage pie crust and stick it in the oven for 20 minutes and then you can put your chicken pot pie filling in it. Look at that. Look at that. It looks so good. Oh, look at that. Those potatoes and onions and those carrots and celery pieces. And then somehow magically a bunch of peas just showed up for the party. I bet those are going to be good too. I mean, how can you have a chicken pot pie? Without some bees. Oh yeah, so we gotta we gotta bake this. Twenty minutes, and then we gotta put all of our other stuff in there. We gotta put our uh, condensed chicken soup sauce. That's just so gross. It's always been gross, but us Americans we use it so much. So we'll get our, our little filling mix going. We're gonna get that baked and toasty and then we're gonna toss all our fillings in there and then we're gonna put a little little some pie crust up on top and we're gonna bake that mug and then we gonna eat it we gonna eat it we gonna eat it all up tonight oh yeah all right all right all right so we got our base layer of the dough set up and we got our veg ready. We're gonna put in our gravy mixture, whatever this nonsense is. We're gonna fold this a couple few times. And we're gonna toss in our chicken. 
uh, because I'm kind of worried about being really light and loose with how we toss the chicken so that way it doesn't crumble up all like crazy like yeah it'll be nice and soft and gentle oh look at all those veggies I love veggies I can't I've said this multiple times on this I love vegetables I love veggies so much they really I just I love vegetables. If I was a vegetarian, man, it'd be pretty damn awesome. But I'm not, because I like my meat. Ooh, that's nice and folded in real good. Oh, yeah. Ooh, now. Toss that chicken in. Ba boom And... Let's fold all that chicken, those little chicken cubies up in there for our chicken pie pie casserole. Oh, that's thick. Yeah, because you know how I like them. I like them thick. T-H-I-C-C, motherfucker. What? Thick. So, what we're going to do with this. Ooh. Yeah. do with this though boys we're gonna put this over here in this fucking pie pan man and then we're gonna put some uh, a couple more pie across on top and we're gonna make us a chicken pot pie casserole thick t-h-i-c-c all capital letters bro uh, oh yeah mmm yeah, look at that. It's all of our pot pie stuffing in that pot pie, boy. I guess we gotta get all fancy and put the pie crust on top. Yeah, I scored it. Why? I don't know why, but it's gonna be cool. So I'm gonna cook this for a little bit. And then I'm going to put a butter wash on top of it. And we're going to see what happens. It's going to look ugly, but it's going to be tasty. Oh, yeah. Keep on cooking, baby. Just experiment. Have fun with food. That's all you need to do. Have fun. Oh, wow. Look. Oh, that's so cool. Woo. Look. Mmm, so tasty. Oh, I can't wait to eat all of it. Alright, alright, 